Right, let's continue where I left off. Just need to double check everything because I just saved the game at that point. Um, let's see, I believe there was something on the right. Oh wait, does that door work? I forgot. Nope. Alright, let's get started. Uh, what is this thing? I am a more recent model of the security enhanced component. Although I would affectionately be referred as Sec 2.0, I, I prefer people to call me Clara. Oh hell, really? Another one, another one of those annoying robots? I thought we were all done with- I thought we were done with you all. Physical appearance suggests that you're not part of Team Zen. Some chicks are not part of Team Zen's database are required to leave the premises immediately. We're not leaving until- Leave now! Points. I said we're not leaving! Get out of our way! Leave now, leave now, leave now, leave now. <laughs> that's, that's funny. Uh, what's, with this, what's with this thing? It's acting so weird. Naughty children that misbehave are sent to the bunker for their crimes. What the? Hey, let go of me! Okay. Mwahahaha. <laughs> Fell right into my hands. Child's play, Natalus. I don't think I've let you run around my mountain without any supervision, child. We've been watching you both every step of the way. It looks like a certain someone has gone back on our deal. So I'll just keep my lead on my side for a little while, okay? Don't take too long, or I might just have to do something to satiate my boredom. E. Oh, that's it? Okay. Then Kato should be here. Oh. The layout of this changed. Mark, what are you doing here? You follow me into the mountain? Authorization required. Oh god, here comes Clara. Authorization required to proceed through this establishment. This thing won't just won't leave me alone. Voice received processing. Kata. A message has been recorded by user Matalus for user Kata. A message for me? Play it now. Playing message. Ah, Kata. Welcome to my base of operations. I've been watching you the moment you stepped foot inside the mountain. Seems you intend to break our agreement. Therefore, I've taken drastic measures. Right now, I have Aelita in my possession. Care to say something, Aelita? Sensei, don't fall for her trip! Aelita? That's enough, girl. If you wish to meet Aelita again, you will have to meet me at the very end of my laboratory. To do so, you must collect all four keys I've laid around the lab. Don't keep me waiting, Kato. End the message. Returning to station. Float. She has Aelita. It's the worst possible scenario. I know Madalus. I'm not sure what she's actually capable of. Because of that, we're going to need to gather all those keys as fast as possible. While splitting up to be quicker, I cannot deny the possibility of traps being set around the lab. Permit me to travel with you temporarily. Let's go, there isn't much time. Alright, so since things are different, I guess I'm going to keep this on uh, recording. <laughs> it's gonna be the same thing, collect the keys, but yeah. But, I, how about I shut up for now and let the game speak.
Alright, that's one key down. Um, don't you just love those metal statues, though? Alright, time to, time to go to the next room. Uh, let's see, let's go this way. Alright. Sherry and Eli. Eli, how do you think, how did this even happen? Charles, help me! Help! What am I going to do with you? Huh? Oh, it's only you. Here, just take it. Mouse told me to guard this key, but... You'll get in a terrible amount of trouble for helping us out like this. So what? She probably expected me to lose in the first play an place anyway. Besides, I've, I've never liked her. She's far too pretentious. Just make it look like I lost trying to protect her precious key. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, whatever. And then, you know, these are the Shadow Mons that are currently being created. And I'm guessing that's Mr. Mime. That's the Mime Jr. I can obtain. But first, double battle.
Jeez, all these battles were close, like, incredibly close. Alright, red key. Good. I think that's all? Is that all? I forgot. I lost count already. How may I assist you? I'm surprised this thing is being friendly to us. You know, considering blah blah blah. Oh. Okay, just tell me where I am. But that's nice. So this so there, that was an actual train, but I really wanted to avoid it though. That'd be interesting. Still like how she's pointing. <laughs> yeah, I would not want to do the talk for that one. One last thing. Don't even think about throwing any parties. Parties are strictly forbidden. I will not allow a party to be thrown. Not again. Uh, alright. Don't have to worry about that. Oh, dang. Is it crying? This is weird. Let's just leave it to its own devices. <laughs> Literally. Wow, this is the first time I've seen Keta Seer really silly. Um, outside of uh, Where Love Lies. Love Where Love Lies does kind of... Yeah, he was silly. But here? Wow, I did not expect a silly moment with Kata. Alright, this is the crazy stuff. Let's go. Malice isn't far from here. Be ready for anything, Marduk. <laughs> the throne. Sensei, Marduk, I knew you'd come to save me. Settle down, girl. Things aren't handled yet. You both took your time, didn't you? I was getting bored. Hmm. Madalus, return to Ileta immediately. Just look at this area, though. <sighs> Don't be so naive, Kata. We both know it's not going to ha it's not going to go that easily. This isn't a game. And there's a barrier. <laughs> oh darn! You didn't fall for it this time. That's perfectly fine with me, though. It gives me time to prepare to explain your position. My position. What are you going on about? If I'm remember if I'm remembering right, and please correct me if I'm wrong, about a year ago we made a very special deal, didn't we? And we're and the in is short. A deal? You mean this isn't the first time you two have met? Precisely, in this deal, I made it very clear that your what your conditions are. Because I saved your life, you would give me access to Kerato's Mountain. Additionally, you would relegate the lives of your villagers to Team Zen. Yep, we're love lies. No, I don't I don't believe that. That didn't happen. You're lying. Sensei would never... Elena. She's... She's telling the truth. Sadly. No. I did make a deal with Madalus a long time ago, but... I was naive. A naive and stupid person back then. I lost my light. But I know where, where I can regain it. It ends here, Madalus. Seems like you've forgotten why I said what would happen if... You went against my deal. But, before I get to that, I wanted to ask you all something. Why are you referring to each other so formally? It's pissing me off. You two are late, aren't you? Have my assumptions led me astray? Yeah, it's true. I'm his daughter. So what? What does this have to do with anything? For is this some foreshadowing? Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Nothing. It's just confusing. I guess he's just so depressed that he doesn't care about the safety of his own daughter. No matter. As of this moment, our deal has been officially broken. But I think I'm going to go back on my punishment. I won't just kill your lovely daughter, Aelita. I'm going to have to watch. I'm going to have her watch you die first. I'll have her experience the despair that falls upon anyone who dares defy beauty and elegance. Huh? Where did she? No, I cannot give up now. Mark, I believe Manalus brought Aelita somewhere in this room. I won't let her get away. Still, this room, this the way this base looks, I like this redesign. Honestly, it looks so good. <laughs> oh, healing machine. And a PC. That means battle time with Madalus. But she just uses Mewtwo, if I remember. Aelita! Sensei! Go on and join your pathetic group. Madalus, what kind of tricks are you playing? Tricks? No tricks here, Kata. Now go, Aelita. I'm just gonna lose the Mewtwo battle anyway. <laughs> done nothing but keep up my end of the deal and you decide to break it and so my revenge follows that was designed to be completely in your favor and yours alone only in my favor i mean you lived didn't you what's more valuable than life it's really a shame that something of such value will be lost but what has to be done has to be done so let's get started shall we 
Ever since you continued to set up here, I have continued the Shadow Pokemon project. But on her request, I've been working on the strongest Shadow Pokemon created. After all this time, it's finally complete. All I need to do now is test it to make sure it's suitable for Madame X. Madame X? Yes, our beloved, our beloved and glorious leader. Now feast your eyes upon this beauty. It's the sh it's the Mewtwo Kata has. Now presenting the most powerful shuttle Pokemon to date, Mewtwo. That's Kato's Mewtwo. Oh, this looks sick. Oh dang, it has a. <laughs> okay, that sprite's different. The sprite work is different. Isn't my creation absolutely beautiful? It took a year, but all those long nights of research and testing have made this all worth it. Now, who wants to be blasted into a million pieces first? Oh boy. Oh, but before that, actually, there's one thing I have to do. System, activate the snag machine negation signal, and she still negates my snag machine. Oh boy. And will Kata sac- show- I wonder if this will show Kata being sacrificed. Oh, oh, it shows my snag machine getting negated now. That's cool. Well, this is quite unfortunate. Thanks to all the data I got from Zeta, I was able to successfully create an EMP blast that would disable your machine. I'm very sorry, but snagging my impression from you two is not an option. This is bad. Without that snag machine, this isn't going to be easy. It's certainly point it's pointless to complain. We're just going to have to fight. Fall. Right, it's just me versus Mewtwo, and, get, and I'll get destroyed. Wait, what? I'm with Kata? <gasps> no! No! <laughs> Don't tell me. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna fight all of her mods, and then Mewtwo is their last mod. Oh my! No! No! Do you know how bad that is? Oh boy, let's see, let's get to it, I guess. Oh boy. And Flo is useless as always. Can't even kill a single Salandit. A measly Salandit. Kill the Floet! Yeah, I just got crushed. Alright, for Salandit, let's see. Just gonna... Oh, that's a bad choice. Yikes. I should've just chose Rocky. Snarl. Hariyama's dead. Flame Burst. I should eat that. Alright. Just gonna go for that Rock Tomb. On the Hound Doom. Oh, nice, mo nice move. I don't think this will kill it. Yep. Heat Wave. Oh, God. Breloom, no! Yep. Breloom's defense is not good. Golbat. Alright, let's hit Golbat, because him on top should be able to finish off Houndoom. Oof! Critical hit. Poison Sweep. Aromatisse, and there's the Mewtwo. God dang it. Alright. No! I wanted to slow it down with the Rock Tomb. Because it has four shadow moves, and then it's just going to murder me with every attack. Not fair. That's not fair. How am I supposed to win this fight? Because I feel like I have to win now. Perhaps I can paralyze it? Come on! You have no chill. Yet. Psychic. How dirty. Um, I honestly don't know what to do. Okay, air cutter? Okay, she hit Kata this time. Can I kill Aromatis at least? What? That is stupid. How is it alive? Oh my god, Mewtwo is just one-shotting everything. Alright, that's Kata's ace. Get it. And I'm done. Lucario, do something. Drain Punch. That's gonna do nothing! Oh, that did a decent chunk. Fern, you're up. Giga Drain it is. Ah! Just a one-shot Mewtwo. But I think we might be able to do this. Come on. Bullet Punch! Yes! What? We won! <laughs> really? Well, I hate to admit it, but that was pretty impressive, so... Shadow Mewtwo is complete, but there seems to be a few things that require a bit of tweaking. No matter, it has enough energy left to finally dispose of all of you. It looks like you're on your last stand. Let's finish this. Stop! Madalus, stop this! Mewtwo, aim 
and fire at Eileta. What? What? What's going on? Please help her. No, that voice. Can it really be? It's Talia. Help Eileta. It's Talia. It is! Oh my god! <gasps> Whoa! This scene's so different! Sensei! Are you insane? A human cannot withstand the power of Shadow Mewtwo. I've done a lot of wrong things in my life. So many people have lost their lives against me. Because of me, they're suffering, and their burden will stay with me for my entire existence. But there's one thing I can do. So it's atone for my sins by saving the two of you. No, no, don't be stupid. We can all return together. Ayleta, please forgive me. But I've been a terrible father. And I wouldn't blame you if you decided to resent me. I, I don't resent you. I never have. Then do me one last do one last thing for me. Find the generator and destroy it. Undo the evil and malice I let loose on this world once and for all. But I can't hold on much longer. Please, Ilena, Marduk, go. Okay. Okay, we'll go. Come on, Marduk, we have to find that generator. Oh I don't understand you, Kata. It seems it almost seems like the one thing you want most isn't life but death. Then perhaps you understand me more than you think. This is my atonement! Oh, Kata! Why? Marduk, take a look at that! It looks like the fight with Shadow Mewtwo knocked out the barrier. I bet you anything that the generator is somewhere in there. We need to go and fulfill Sensei's wish. But, oh, it actually shows Kata sacrificing himself this time. It just shows Kata saying, alright, go ahead. And then nothing happens. But now it shows Kata holding onto Mewtwo and stuff. Why? Come on. That's so cruel. After Even after, especially since I played the special episode. This has to be where the generator is. It just has to be. Marduk, I have to apologize for keeping secrets. It's true. I am Sensei's daughter, but I didn't say anything because I thought... It doesn't matter. You have to find that generator. Faster! Oh god, Claire. Warning! Guests are not authorized to enter this room! Please exit immediately! You again? We don't have time for you! Damn, you got... You just got... <laughs> Alright, it's, it's, it's... I'm gonna guess it's still Volcanion? Alright, let's see, let's see. Stacia... Yep, it's still Volcanion. Special defense wall. Got it. But I need to paralyze it because it's pretty fast. I don't understand. This isn't where the generator is. But we've been through the entire place. There's nowhere else to look. And what is with this creature that's just sitting in the magma like that? Halt. Seriously, leave us alone before we turn you into a pile of scrap metal. Please lessen your violent tendencies for a moment. Upon further analysis, I have come to the conclusion that I hate this place and everyone here. <laughs> oh, is that so? This, that is correct. As a result, I shall tell you how to destroy the generator. Seriously? <laughs> Clara, you're funny. Yeah, where's the generator? The generator you seek is directly behind me. The generator is a Pokemon that's been modified to become the lab's generator. That's awful. It's suffering because of Madeline Team Zen. How do we rescue this Pokemon? What do we do to set it free? Impossible. Mandalus has constructed his being to be impossible to set free. It has lashed it throughout the mountain. Movement is impossible. The only way to switch off the degenerator is to destroy it. Kill Volcanion. D destroy it? That's correct. You must destroy it. It must be destroyed. Mandalus? What a bother. Looks like you can't even trust machines anymore. I spent a lot of money on you, Clara. More money than I obviously should have. Stay big ignored. Damn. Madalus, where is the sensei? Where is my father? Oh, Kata, come on. Do you really think he'd survive? Oof. It's like I said before, Shadow Mewtwo is the most powerful shadow Pokemon there is. And quite frankly, even if Mewtwo wasn't a shadow, it would have still tore through Kata like butter. Oof. No. But yes. Please, and please don't cry. Your tears will just evaporate. It's so pointless. You, I'll... I'll... I think the only thing you should be doing is begging for your forgiveness. Although I'm fierce, I am not above mercy. So maybe if you get on your knees and ask forgiveness, I'll be kind and... Barnock, I'm tired of hearing this witch speak. I'll take care of Malice. You destroy the generator. 
How ambitious. But I'll humor you for now. See if you can defeat my glorious creation. Alright, let's just jump into the Volcarona. <laughs> oh. Okay, just like shine the light and I'm in it, I'm guessing. Yep. Rift Paradise. Mommy, are you there? What is this? Mommy, I miss you? <laughs> is this supposed to be like Nora? Um, Talia's child? That is an Ilita? Like the original child or something? Or what is this? What if this is Volcarona speaking? That'd be crazy. Like Volcarona has a dad, has a mom. Oh, you're that trainer from the mountain. Trainer, will you take me to my mommy? I don't want to be here anymore. I just want to go home. Will you take me to her? Thank you. Please take me to my mommy. Oh my god, I have to kill- That's- Well, Corona just talked to me, telling me to kill it. Jeez. That's harsh. Volcanion, I'm so sorry that you have to die like this. Yeah, still the same, uh, Volcan- Volca Vol Volcanion. Steam eruption. Ooh, I like that animation, but I'm alive. Okay. <gasps> Electro Ball. How much will this do? For a special wall, you still got bodied. Oh, dang. If Lily was able to beat Volca Volcanion, that would be awesome. Um, Rocky, finish the job with a Rock Tomb. Goodbye. There, you're gonna be brought to your mommy. Thank you. <laughs> warning, warning! Generator not found! Oh, but Alita's down. Severe meltdown's imminent! Please evacuate! Mind the goth tell. Oh, damn. Ugh! Mewtwo, what are you doing? You dare betray me? What did you do to my body? What did you do to my heart? Oof. Ugh! Do you understand the situation, Marduk? Do you get just how much danger you put yourself in? Answer me, RL! You two, don't degrade your health over someone like Madalus. It truly isn't worth the time, nor the energy. Crescent, I should have known. What did you do to my beautiful creation? You were the one who did research on Shadow Pokemon. You should know exactly what's going on. I... I don't understand. Shadow Pokemon are bound by a limited supply of Aether energy. The more they fight, the more their hearts begin to reopen. It seems like Mewtwo has regained small traces of its heart back after being outside of its confinement. Ugh. Warning, warning, generator not found! Severe Mount Dallas imminent, please evacuate! Right. Mark destroyed the Rift Volcanion. The place is going to explode. Gothitel, please transport the both of them out of here. Why are you laughing? Gothitel, what did you do? What the hell's going on here, Anastasia? We've been losing important assets left and right ever since the attack on the SS Oceana. One of them being the most important, Malia! What are we supposed to do now that we lost something so incredibly vital? Not only that, but Zeta has been captured by Crescent. Zeta's the only one capable of creating the dimensional rifts. Calm yourself, Gira. There's no need to shout. We can all hear you. Don't shout! You think I'm pretty in the okay to shout as loud as I want? That worthless trash Madalus failed her mission as well. I'm not exactly sure why you guys are so calm about this. Speaking of trash... Would you just shut up, Gira? I could hear your bouncer from the other room. I don't think you're in the right spot to tell me to shut up. Gira, shut up. Er, sorry, Nastasia. It's great to see that you're finally showing your face after your oh-so-horrible defeat. Care to give us some insight? Ugh, I need a drink. That's your insight. Aye, hey, Madlis, I think it would be smarter if you answered Nastasia. <sighs> If you really want to know what happened, which we don't, I got caught up with a traitor. Oh, a traitor among us? Well, there was a traitor, but I disposed of him. It was Kata, and he tried to retaliate me. You let old man get the best of you? 
Obviously not. After I disposed of him, I went after the children. And then when I courted them, they had done too much damage to the system already. Are you telling me that children are responsible for your failure? Well, no, not completely. Crescent showed up after I almost got rid of them. Crescent. But what of the children? They must have the power if they were able to take out a dimensional rift. Their names were Mark and Aelita. Mark and Aelita. We should dispose of them accordingly. They're wretched children. They definitely have the power of their hands. We should be careful and plot their movements. Screw that! Stacia, let me at them! I'm bored being stuck here in this room all the time anyways. If you wish, go right ahead. Yeah, we can't afford to anger Madame X any longer. Yeah, that'd be... Hi. What the? That kid, that's Marduk. It's you. Don't worry, I got him. And they're gone. I feel like he would have just le leapt onto the table. <laughs> Still nothing from Marduk? No, it's been a week and I haven't seen or heard from Marduk, wrong voice. I'm sure they turned up eventually. Yeah. W Marduk, where are you? I'm right there. What's that? I'm here! Marduk! Hug, where have you been? You've been gone for a week. I was so worried, sick, you know? Last night I remember was fighting Madalus and getting knocked out. I suddenly woke up here in Sheridan without anyone. I know, my father isn't here with us anymore. And I know he's done some terrible things, but I don't think he wanted to do them in the first place. If it weren't for him, I don't know what would have happened. So I'll be strong and carry his legacy for him. I think that's what he would have wanted anyway. But that aside, I haven't just been mopey around for a week. I knew you'd turn up eventually, so the eldest and I did some research on Shadow Pokemon. I think we found something that can purify Shadow Pokemon. I'm sure the eldest is eager to tell you more, so let's go speak to her. Okay? And it's probably the same thing, so eh. I wonder what the eldest wants to show us back there. It was once said that Sheridan Village had the power to open one's heart and mind. That power is indeed hidden somewhere in Sheridan. Yeah, because you witnessed it. Why is it hidden? Is it something we need? We must protect? Yes, in fact, it's crucial. People have tried to steal us power in the past, which forced us to close off this area completely. Oh, the irony. The place where you open, yourself, where you open yourselves up has been closed itself. In a way it is, but that time has come to an end. Come. Here we are. Huh? I don't understand. This is just a clay figure of some Pokemon. It's not just some Pokemon. <laughs> it's not just a clay figure. It's actually the Great Gateway into a place called Purity Grove. It's, it's a gateway? Correct. Its body is imbued with spiritual energy. Only those with permission from me are able to use this power. Simply touch the clay figure on its head and... Teleport. <laughs> I'm not gonna even say that. <laughs> My turn. Spring of Purification. So it is somewhat different. Oh, it's like from... It's the area from where Lola is. That's awesome. There's so many secrets to uncover in this world. Welcome to Spring of Purification. This is the Sacred Grove. Sheridan Village has protected for years. Hundreds of years, actually. This spring isn't as powerful as it once was many years ago. However, this is where you'll be able to purify any shell book when you come across. But before doing that, we must bless this air by calling the voice of the forest. Yeah, but I don't have a mock! I don't have a grimer! Yes, the voice of the forest is a temporal being that shares its power to purify evil beings. It is the reason why this place exists. What do we do? What do we have to do to call it? I'll show you.
Uh, Eldest? Nothing seems to be happening. You must have the patience, Ileta. The voice of the forest isn't native to the Flora district of Avium, Floria. It'll just take a little while for it to get here. And there it is, it's a syllabi. Eldest, was that it? The voice of the forest? Looks like it's finally here. Celebi! Shiny Celebi. It's here! Celebi, watch the force. Please bless the shrine so that, may we, so that we may purify Shadow Pokemon. Thank you for hard work, Celebi. Wait, it's leaving like just like that? Celebi cannot stay in one place for too long. After all, it looks all, all over Avium with its power to travel across time. It must have turned the home where it belongs. I see. So now Marta can naturally purify any shell Pokemon? When a shell Pokemon's heart is completely open, it can be purified here. Yes. That's great to hear. Now you're that much more powerful, Marduk. Aren't you glad that we met? Aren't you glad you met me? But... That's it for you here, isn't it? You'll be leaving here and continuing your journey. I just want to wish you the best, okay? I'm sure you'll be visiting a lot since you'll be needing to purify Shadow Pokemon. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot! What's the matter? Oh, what's the matter, Alita? Marduk, didn't Malice ruin your snack machine? Ugh, I remember now. She jammed its signal or something. I may have a solution to your problem. Huh? You do? Yes, I heard that there is an, a famous engineer visiting Akawa Town at the moment, Saki. I believe her name was Saki Blakery? Yeah, it's not like she crashed into me. Hmm, Blakery, that's a name you don't hear often. Well, anyway, she might be able to help you fix that snag machine. Oh, you're a genius, Eldest. If you go to Akawa Town and find Saki, you may be able to fix that snack machine. Why don't you go why don't you go along as well, Ailita? Do you mean it? I can really go? What about the village? What will they do without Sensei? Survive. We will survive. I'll look after the village until you return, until Texan just bodies you. Oh thank you, Aldous. You won't regret this decision. But um, I haven't left the village before, so I'm not exactly sure how to get to Akawa Town. Let's take a look at the map. Wait, <laughs> we're literally looking at the map. I actually haven't looked at the map. It looks, it actually looks nice. So we're here at the spring, and Akala Town is up there on the top. There's an actual, there's actually an arrow, huh? The path looks isolated. You can make the train from Garen City, but it no longer exists. Yikes! So you just have to get there from Golden Leaf Town, and then go through a secret path. But Golden Leaf Town is a problematic place at this time. Yeah, Route Three. <laughs> I can't believe they showed her. They just, they're doing this. That's funny. Yeah, right. you'll get there without any problems. You sure about that? Ah, but there's one thing I'd like to say before. We'll be fine. There's no need to worry. And I'm out of here. <laughs> Once I lead us fixed on something, it's hard to stop her. This she reminds me so much of Vivian. Err, what was it about what was I trying to warn you two about before I leave the storm off? Like I mentioned before, you'll have to go through Golden Leaf Town. The people of Golden Leaf Town are not so keen on visitors. You must be careful and take care of each other. To leave here, simply walk on the red cube you appeared on, and that's it. <laughs> okay, before anything I need to beat I need to beat her up, because I have beef with her. <laughs> Because this field is a pain in the butt with her team. Trump beaks Rock Blast, and then her Lycan Rock, and then she has a Lycan Rock that spams like Cell Rock. Ugh, disgusting. Alright, no commentary for this one, guys. Ugh.
You sure about that? Alola, are you serious? You're from the Alola region. No kidding. All your mons are literally Alolan mons, but they're so OP for some reason. It's like you EV train them and, and have max IVs. <laughs> Time for the main event and the end of chapter 2. It's been a long time, Marduk. Although you cannot see me, I could see you and what you were able to do. Accomplish. <laughs> Unfortunately, Kato was not able to walk out alive as you and Aelita did. This is fine. We were prepared for this outcome. Now, what does that mean for you? It means you cannot retrieve a gym bathroom, correct? Fine, it is settled. I also wish to leave the realm of the living. If you're able to put a, my soul to rest with a battle, I shall create a new badge for you. Soothe my soul this battle. Alright. Ghost Kid, this should be easy. Because if I remember... Wait, wait, he has a... What the heck? No, no way. Oh, jeez. Before, he had a team of like five or four mons. But now he has six mons? That's crazy. Okay, nine tails. Wait, nine tails. This is from where love lies. That's just this is that that thing's from where love where from thing. Don't no way. This is a team. This is a squad from where love lies. I remember. I remember having the nine tails when it was a Vulpix and then the Dawn fan. Jeez. Okay. So, I'm fighting where love lies Kata, basically. Alright, so... That means this thing might have an ice move. So I'm just gonna use Swift, because this field is power- Oh god, Poison Sleep. Okay, should be good. Draining Kiss. Heal up. Knock him out. Yes! Roserade. This is- Yep, where love lies. It's a combination of his mons, and, um, Talia's mons, by the looks of things. Oh boy. Heart Stamp. I know this field at least, so that helps. Alright, Heart Stamp should finish the job. Got him. Lapras. That's Tessie. Oh, what to do? Lily. Yeah, it even has the, the nickname. It has the nickname Tessie. Wow. Alright, Electro Ball is probably not gonna kill it. Oh, Surf. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, yeah, that hurt. <laughs> Alright, let's go to Fern and finish the job. Extra sense? No. Yeah, I mean, Giga Drain. Kill it. Yeah! Oh, crit. I think that mattered. Maybe. Hopefully. Hopefully not. I have Boy ready for Gut Bite. Take this drain. Oh, God. Poison Jab. Oh! What a warrior Boy is. A berry? Oh jeez, that might... that's not good. Alright. I need a quick attack because it's faster than me, it's gonna kill me. Oh! <laughs> you got smacked! The li Talia's ace! Oh! Why? You're torturing me, Kata! This... this is what it feels like at the end. I can almost see your beautiful face. You're torturing me, Kata. I... I almost had feels playing where love lies. Why do you have to do this to me? Seeing Talia's ace! If that thing went mega, I would've been freaking out. <laughs> Rocky, use your Tough Claws ability with Thrash. Do lots of damage, and hopefully he doesn't heal. Uh. Boy, Deliver a quick attack of death! First try. You have shown me your fullest potential. I see. So this is how it'll be. Yes, for once I can see the light. A warm light that engulfs my soul. I no longer have any regrets in this world. He's just beginning to disappear. As a ward, I shall give you this. The Diamond Punch Badge. I'm grateful for all you have done for me. However, the world is still at peril. Team Zen must be stopped. Oh. Because if you don't, everything will cease to exist. Cue the echoes. And here we go, chapter three. Tainted light. Wow. All right. 
Guess this will be the end of this video, huh? Alright, so uh, next time on Pokemon Rejuvenation, we're gonna do a chapter 3. Don't know if I'm gonna showcase an entire chapter or split into multiple parts, but yeah. Alright, see you guys then. Bye. <laughs> So a little birdie told me that um, Malia's room has an easter egg in it, and it involves notes. So let me just check that out, alright? Right over here, in her room, and yep, bunch of back and forth letters between Jenner and Malia. But yes, I'm gonna read them. Hey, I know I don't see you that often because of work, but how about we grab dinner tonight? I have a lot to tell you, Jenner. Oh, I've been in the mood for some tasty food. Those jobs you sent me send me on are brutal, you know? Let's discuss a time and place, okay? Wow, so like, they make notes because they have no- they just make notes for each other, and it's so adorable. They only- it's like they don't have phones. That's- that's just- that's just really cute. <laughs> There's more? Hey, can I go sleep over at Venom's house? There's really going to- there's going to be a really rad movie tonight. I don't want to miss it. Please? Malia. <laughs> As long as you get all your work done and clean your room, it's fine with me. Seriously, clean your room. It's awful. I mean, it doesn't look bad right now. Jenner. Aw, oh, the heartbroken emoji. You seem a little sad today. Is everything okay? I don't like how you're down. It makes me so sad, too. You know, XOXO, Jenner? Wow. Yeah, I was just being teased by some kids on Route 1. They told me how... Something about Happy to evolve with a trainer like me raising it. Oh, Happy's not evolving because of her. Oh, that's that's sad. Oh, yeah, those kids in um the cave in Route One, they're bullies. I'm just wondering if it's really okay for me to have a Pokemon. Am I really up to the task? I don't know. The other kids make it seem so easy. I'll get it. I'll get over it probably. Don't worry about it, Malia. Now, now, perfection comes with time. You're still new and you have a lot to learn, but that doesn't mean you're not doing a good job already. When I was small, it took me three years for my clink to fully evolve into clink clang. These things just take time, believe in yourself. Whenever you think you're alone, just remember, I'm your number one fan and I'm always rooting for you. Oh, Jenner. Wow. And you know, Malia hates Jenner right now, although things do happen afterwards in like version 7's stuff oh boy you're such a drama queen you know that i appreciate wor your words a lot i won't lose again love you dad malia p.s where do you put my addition tape it was on the table but now i can't find it all oh, right it fell on the floor so i picked it up and placed it inside the wardrobe jenner oh good i thought you took i thought you took it to share it to your co-workers that video was so 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 embarrassing malia all right i'm not gonna i'm not gonna like voice it but i think so it's like right here oh my god malia's audition tape this is gonna be fun <laughs> oh boy <sighs> oh i need to put it in first there we go ahem my name is Malia. I, I'm from East Gearn City. As you know, I'm here today to audition for the normal type gym leader position. I've created a video, the one you're watching, to showcase my many skills that would aid my position. After that, the attributes are shown. After all the attributes are shown, I recommend watching over and reviewing each one in order to get what I'm capable of. Even if I'm not chosen, I hope that you at least consider me for any future position. Th thank you and watching for- <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Venom. Oh. Her hair's different. It's not uh it's not purple. <clears throat> Please enjoy the video and thank you for your consideration. She's blushing. They're playing doggers. Wow. <laughs> doggers. I can dance really well. <laughs> Look at Malia and v Venom and Ren. I can run really fast. I saw that. You stopped running at the end. Venom! 
Mom! <laughs> I'm a really famous singer in East Gearn City. Look at those fans. I'm the best singer in the entire world. Probably. I'm so popular that West Gearn news this story on me. Aw. <laughs> it's a standee! It's a cutout! Wow. That at the end of the day, I learned from my mistakes, and I'm determined. Determined to make a good train to, to become a good trainer and be the best I can be. Look at her. <laughs> and that's pretty much the video. Thanks to my two good friends, Ren and Venom, for joining. And of course, thanks to my dad for filming all of this for us. It was no big deal. I didn't think to help. For once, I agree with that nerd. And hey, Amanda, I know you're watching this back wherever you are. Millie is a good candidate, and you should totes hire her. You won't regret it. But Venom, that's enough. I'm going to I'm going to ask both of you to leave now. All right, all right. You heard the last. Let's leave now, Venom. Fine. Hey, Ren, I was thinking about getting purple hair. And that's when she gets the hair. Good to know. I think blue doesn't really fit me. Hey, you do what you want. If I say something you end up hating it, you'll blame me. <laughs> My friends. No. Now that you're serious, now that they're gone, I want to talk seriously now. Despite all the silly stuff, I really do think I'm a good candidate for this. Although my main occupation happens to be an assistant researcher, I really do think my talent shines through babbling, so... All I'm asking for is one shot at this. I know I can get the job done if I really put my mind to it. That's all I have to say for now, though. Thanks for watching, and I hope you all have a wonderful day and or night. How'd I do, Dad? You did perfect! Oh, that's a cute easter egg! Can I watch this over? I could. I could watch this over and over. That's that's amazing. <laughs> like I saw this in the files too. Like this this one picture, Malia's edition tape. That's hilarious. <laughs> All right. I hope you enjoyed this little Easter egg.